Dave, welcome to Southampton. What was it about the, the challenge of coming here that attracted you? I think um, when you see the facilities that we're, we're looking at today and knowing that they're an established Premier League club and the opportunity to work with, with Ronald and, and the staff that have been brought to the club, it's a fantastic opportunity for me to develop as a coach and obviously come and work in these wonderful facilities. Has it been a bit of a, a whirlwind few days for you? It's been uh, an interesting few days, shall we say. Yeah, unfortunately, obviously, came back from Brazil and uh, had uh, the disappointment of obviously not getting out of the group stages with the national team um, and then kind of getting the, the phone call to try and come and join uh, what, what is now a, you know, a great opportunity in a fantastic football club. What was it that, that they said to you, the other members of staff, to, to attract you to, to take this challenge? Well, I think when, when you meet everybody, you know, um, you, and, and they have the same football philosophy and thoughts for moving things forward and playing football, and, and obviously then you come to the training ground and you see it all, you, you know, you get a real belief that you can work together and be progressive and uh, hopefully, you know, keep, keep Southampton's progressions moving forward. You mentioned those footballing philosophies. What is it you like to, to see from a team that you're involved with? Well, obviously we want we want to play attractive football, but we we want to play football. You know, we want to we want to keep it and we want to pass it. And I think if we can keep the simple philosophies moving forward, I think that'll you know uh, hopefully excite the the Southampton public. How have those those first impressions been? I imagine there's been a, a lot of conversations had over the last 24 hours or so in terms of planning for the new season. And, and as you say, seeing these new facilities as well, it must have been quite a, an enjoyable day or so for you so far. Yeah, it's been a fantastic day. Obviously, we've met some wonderful people and, you know, people have been really bending over backwards to help us all. So it's been great. Um, and obviously, we're just now planning the, the finer details of the, of the work for the rest of this week. Um, and obviously the players report back tomorrow, so that's something we're looking forward to. Having worked in the Premier League for the last couple of seasons, you've obviously seen how Southampton have, have progressed over the last two years or so. What are your, your impressions of, of how this club's developed recently? Well, what, what they've done is obviously, you know, they've managed to get promoted to the Premier League, which is a, always a tall order in itself, but they've managed to push on and develop and move forward. And obviously last season had a fantastic run and, and established themselves, you know, right in the higher echelons of the, of the league, which is you know, some going. So, you know, they've obviously done things the right way and it's uh, important for us now to try and uh, maintain that standard. It has been a bit of a transitional period probably for the club over the last six or seven months. Is that, as a coach, quite exciting to be involved in, you know, sort of forming a, a new project and a new stage in the club's development? Yeah, for, for, for me, it's a wonderful opportunity to come and join the football club, but it's also a wonderful opportunity to work with Ronald and his staff and uh, obviously see, see, see a different approach um, and, and see if, you know, Sammy and I can blend into that and, and, and obviously learn and, and obviously add our experiences from the Premier League into the mix as well. And I think it'll be a, a good group and obviously it's exciting times ahead. Could you tell us a little bit about your, your experience both as a player and as a coach? Because despite your, your relatively tender years for a coach, you, you have been involved in, in coaching for quite some time now. Yeah, I've been mani uh, managed to coach for quite a while now. Uh, it seems as though my playing career is uh, a, a, a long way away, but I do remember playing for Barnsley at the Dell, um, which weren't the most pleasant experience for us. We got a, on the end of a good hide in there. So, um, but yeah, we I've, I've been obviously to the new stadium uh, with a couple of teams I've worked for in the past and obviously always seen a fantastic home support and uh, you know that's something as a, as a new member of staff I'll actually be looking forward to them actually supporting uh, me and obviously the team rather than working against me. As you mentioned before as well you've obviously been involved with the, the England squad for the last two years how, uh, how enriching an experience has that been for you? Yeah, I think I think for for me uh, as a coach, it's been invaluable. I've learnt so much over the last two years, and even over the last six weeks. Even though we're, we're coming home disappointed, there's a lot of things that we, we we've been able to take away and learn from, and hopefully, you know, as as the uh, you know time moves forward, we'll be in a better position as as the next tournaments come round. So I, th I think always you're learning and trying to progress, and uh, you know I want to bring those experiences to Southampton now. Certainly no, no rest for you, though, with the World Cup having only finished you know, a week or so ago for the England squad. No, but uh, the, the thing is, this is fresh, it's exciting, it's a new challenge. And when you come and stand on this balcony and have a look at the, the surroundings and what you've got to work in and the calibre of players you're going to be working with, you know, that, that lifts and inspires you and uh, you know, there's, there's no problem with that. You'll get to meet the players very shortly. That must be quite exciting for a coach, you know, getting to, to work with a new group so, so soon after joining the club. 
Yeah, I think that's 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 it, isn't it? You know, we've we've had a couple of days looking round and seeing everything, but the whole place will come alive tomorrow when when the players report for pre-season training, and that's when we're at his best and and and, and we, we get out on the grass and start working with the players. That'll be a big moment for us. And to, to be in the splendour, splendour of this new facility is just absolutely fantastic. I'm very, very pleased and delighted to be here.